and welcome back to the TDC Today Show. Joining me is one of our Peel Digital Venture students, James Banshon. Welcome to the show. Thank you, Stephanie. Thanks for having me over. And James is going to be interning as a producer and show host. Yes. Now, before we get to, before I speak with James, I just want to mention when I was talking about the International Day of People with Disabilities before, um, I wanted to mention what the day is for. So it's for uh, five things. It's for reflection, to look at our own past individual and collective actions and to identify our goals for the future. It's for a celebration, to recognize and value the diversity of our global community and to cherish the role we all play regardless of our abilities. Learning, to understand and learn from the experiences of people living with a disability. And it is a day for optimism, to look, for, look towards the future and the creation of a world where a person is not characterized by their disabilities, but by their abilities. And finally, it's a day of action, where all people, organizations, agencies, and charities not only show their support for International Day of People with Disabilities, but take on a commitment to create a world characterized by equal human rights. So that being said, uh, I'm going to talk to you now about your experiences um, and uh, what you hope to learn in Digital Ventures. And uh, let's first talk about your uh, experience. Do you want to, if you could tell the audience about what you're, about, a bit about yourself first. Of course. Um, once again, my name is James and my disability is multiple sclerosis for if anybody knows, MS for short. What it is is an autoimmune disease targeting your spine and brain, uh, affecting your uh, cognitive functions and many other parts of the brain. It's known as an invisible disease, meaning that you look fine, but in, in your body, in your nervous system, everything is being affected in many ways that other people cannot see. Some people need assisted uh, devices. Some people need um, personal support workers and others live independently just fine like mine with minor situations to go through on a daily basis. You were diagnosed pretty young too, right? Yes, um, I was diagnosed when I was 16. And how did that affect as far as your career goals and, and moving forward, how did that affect you? First, let me talk about my motor skills. In order to make it anywhere, you need to be able to commute. MS affected one of those uh, motor functions, but Thanks to the services all over Ontario, I was able to go to my proper place around town in order for me to get my daily things done. So really it's, I'm seeking out for help and that help has been delivered. And your career goals, you have a background in audio engineering. Tell us about that. Yes. Um, for many years, I have studied uh, audio engineering. Similar to film work with, with the technology such as microphones and such, and especially the technology, audio engineers help record that sound, mix it, and design it for, for commercial expectations. It could be anything from a commercial to an album to live performance. So with the Digital Ventures class, that is a, a great background to have because you want to intern as a producer and host. So how do you want to use that at moving forward? What do you want to do? I think Digital Ventures for many things. One of them is helping me find my own voice, helping me realize my own voice. So my plan is I plan to take these skills into into the job industry, hopefully go for radio, open up my own fundraisers, maybe promote uh, music in local areas which I know. And of course, um, help anyone who has a interest in music. And 
Yeah. Hopefully, I will take them to the right path with the knowledge I know, thanks to digital ventures on my presentation skills, and thanks to my uh, audio training for the technological stuff, on my goals for recording music. And you want to learn to be a radio host? Yes. You were saying, yeah. So you're excited about that possibility? I am interested in being a radio host. I, I love being in a station, um, being in front of the camera and, and telling the world what's, what's new for today. I want to be able to spread the world, I mean, the word, whether it be uh, commercial, sports, or music. I want to be able to share that information to the world. Wonderful, James. Well, thank you so much for joining us. Thank you. Thank, thank you for having me.